Hello friends, in engineering drawing subject, today we are going to learn how to draw a different orthographic views of given 3D object using third angle projection method. So here it is our data for the problem. Draw orthographic views of an object, front view, top view and left hand side view using third angle projection method. Now, let us observe the different views of given 3D object with respect to direction of view. So, we can imagine the different orthographic views of given object. With the help of roller scale, draw a vertical line and horizontal line and name the endpoints of horizontal line by point x x and name the endpoints of vertical line by point y y also name the intersecting point by point o as shown with the help of roller scale draw a line parallel to line x x above and below at a distance of 10 millimeters similarly draw a vertical line parallel to line y y ahead and behind at a distance of 10 millimeters. You can take any distance as per your requirement. Now mark the points in each quadrant as shown. These are the reference point for drawing a view in each quadrant. As we know in the case of third angle projection method, we have to draw a front view in third quadrant top view above the front view and left hand side view at the left side of the front view. In our problem, we have to draw a front view, top view and left hand side view. So we will assume this is our first quadrant, this is our second quadrant, this is our third quadrant and this is our fourth quadrant. So we will draw a front view over here and top view above the front view and left hand side view at the left side of the front view. Now to draw a front view, let us observe the front view of given 3D object with respect to direction of view. For drawing a front view over here, our reference point is located at top left corner. So let us find out that point in our 3D object. So that is the point. With the help of roller scale, from that point, draw a vertical line of 50 millimeters, draw a horizontal line of 50 millimeters, draw a vertical line of 10 millimeters, draw a horizontal line of 40 millimeters, draw a vertical line of 40 millimeters, and draw a horizontal line of 10 millimeters. From that point, draw a horizontal line of 30 millimeters, draw a vertical line of 20 millimeters. Draw a horizontal line of 10 millimeters. Draw a vertical line of 20 millimeters as shown. Now our front view is completed. Let me show you the dimensions of the front view so that you can draw it easily. Also mention the name of the view which is front view. Now to draw a top view, let us observe the top view of given 3D object with respect to direction of view. To draw a top view with the help of roller scale, take the projections of the each point of the front view in upward direction as shown. For drawing a top view, our reference point is located at bottom left corner. So let us locate that point in the given 3D object. So that is the point. With the help of roller scale, draw a vertical line of 40 millimeters, horizontal line of 50 millimeters, vertical line of 40 millimeters, and horizontal line of 50 millimeters. From that point, draw a vertical line of 15 millimeters, draw a horizontal line of 40 millimeters. Similarly, from that point, draw a vertical line of 15 millimeters draw a horizontal line of 40 millimeters. From that point, draw a vertical line of 10 millimeters as shown. Now, 
our top view is completed. Let me show you the dimensions of the view so that you can draw it easily. Also mention the name of the view which is top view as shown. Now to draw a left hand side view, let us observe the left hand side view of given 3D object with respect to direction of view. As we know in the case of third angle projection method, we have to draw a left hand side view at the left side of the front view. For that, we have to transfer the projections of the top view. With the help of protector from point O, draw a line of any length at a 45 degree as shown. With the help of roller scale, take the projections of the each point of the top view up to 45 degree line and transfer it in the downward direction as shown. Now with the help of roller scale, take the projections of the each point of the front view in the left hand side direction as shown. To draw a left hand side view, our reference point is located at top right corner. Let us locate that point in the 3D object. So that is the point. From that point, with the help of roller scale, draw a horizontal line of 40 millimeters, vertical line of 50 millimeters, horizontal line of 40 millimeters, and vertical line of 50 millimeters as shown. The edges which are not visible from the left hand side view, we will draw it with the help of hidden line as shown. Now our left hand side view is completed. Let me show you the dimension of this view so that you can draw it very easily. Also mention the name of the view which is left hand side view. Now mention the dimensions in the each view as per the dimensioning rule. I hope you understood it. If you have any questions let me know in the comment box. Thank you.